So here we are at Six Cottage Court. I'll just take a quick look at the outside. I don't think it's probably changed much since on the outside since you've been here. Um, and then we'll go head on in. Not to be in the shadows here. So as you remember, you come through the first door into the pool area. And of course you have the little guest suite over here, which we'll get to in, a, in just a bit. Just taking a quick look at the roof and the outside decking. They may have painted this. Um, pool needs a little bit of a cleaning, but it's a little chilly down here right now, so they're probably not not really using it. Just want to look at the roof on this side as well. And coming in, I believe that they have, um, they, they added this laminate flooring and they've done some painting in here. Of course, as we were talking about the other day, you do have, um, you don't really have a backyard here, so all of your living space uh, in terms of outside living is going to be in that pool area. Okay, let's have a, have a look around here. They have replaced the, uh, the doors, the interior doors. Of course, they are living here, so they have coats in the coat closet. storage here. The bathroom has an automatic light that comes on. They've put new tile in the showers, smoothed out all of the ceilings. And then this bedroom does have a, a door from the bedroom into the into that, that bath that, that I just took a picture of. And then a decent size and very full closet here. Coming into the kitchen and main living area. They've redone the fireplace and I believe that they have put new cabinets in. Um, these feel like they are they are new cabinets not uh, not not painted. If they have been painted yeah they're a soft close cabinet. I was gonna say if they had been painted they really did a nice job. Uh, painting them. So they're all soft clothes. Pantry in here. They added a wine rack up there. And then the subway tile. New sink. Dishwasher. I believe that oven and the cooktop here is original and maybe they, they painted those cabinets. And maybe they painted them all. Um, I'm not sure. I'm looking at, at them now. But uh, anyway, in here you have your washer and dryer and access into the, into the garage. And then this is the room over the garage. Huge bonus room, kids room, double beds up here. But there's not a bath up here. Um, so that's something to to consider and I don't I don't really see any good space to be able to add a bath up here because you really can't I don't know how you come up over this living room space with the taller ceilings again something to consider take a 
walk back through and check out the master. So they've painted the master. Of course, there's access from the master out into the pool. I believe they've they've uh, replaced the baseboards with a bit wider baseboard and and put new casings around the the doors and windows, and then they uh, put tile in the bath. And, and then they just have the white cabinets and double vanity here. They did not do anything with the tub or the shower. And then you have your private commode. And then I'm going to run out to the guest, uh, detached guest suite. I can show you real quick the walk-in closet in the master. Here's I'm on my way out. And then we'll run out to the guest suite. I'll give you a last look here. I'm just coming into the guest suite from the, the bath area, but wanted to, to just remind you of, of this bath right off the pool deck area, which is convenient. They have put a new shower in, in here. Of course, the vanity and then the guest suite itself. And in here, all the ceilings have been smoothed out. Looks like they put some new blinds in, but this is a nice, uh, you know, little mother-in-law area or just a, a place for even a separate office. Um, so here you have it. I hope this, hope this helps. Um, as a reminder, and um, I will talk to you soon. Take care.